How you doing? This is Black Shy Guy. Thanks for sitting at my table once again. As you can see, I'm in bed. I got to go to bed early because I work really early. So it is what it is. Hopefully you guys hit that like button either way. Hit that like button if you really enjoyed the video. Hit the subscribe button for any upcoming new videos. Let's dive into this. McGregor has just released an Instagram video basically. I don't know if it's an Instagram video or what, but it's all over the internet. So I didn't want to make a big video edit video version in response to that Instagram for the simple fact that it was no point. I mean, millions seen the video already. Everybody was anticipating on um, what he might say after he gets out of surgery, which we all are predicting is going to be almost a year and a half return. We're not, we're not going to see McGregor until the year 2023. Period. We're not going to see him until the year 2023. And if he comes back any sooner, it's a big mistake. Like I said in my last two videos, I'm not going to repeat myself. I think he should retire. He's done great things for the UFC. He's entertained us for such a long time. But I don't think the UFC can do any more for him. And he has nothing to prove. Despite the fact that he lost to Dustin Poirier in this fight, he has nothing to prove. He's done great things. And for him to come back, possibly in the year 2023... And to give Dustin Porty another opportunity to possibly be him a third time will make his career even may, will make his career even worse than the way Ronda Rousey left her career. Yeah, it, it will. It will. Right now, if he r gets on a pale white horse and rides off to the sunset and ends his career, it won't be that bad, despite what people may think. Because, A, the star doesn't shine bright on someone forever you know what i mean i think it's time for mcgregor to leave i think it's time for him to seek um other things to do and that doesn't make him any less of a man because he's done great things for all of us he's gave us great entertainment but i think it's time if you haven't checked out his instagram it's all over the internet i mean thank god the surgery went well and um he's doing great and i'm glad um I, um, we all got to see him after the surgery because obviously um, his fans was worried. You know what I mean? And I'm also was happy to see that he's in good spirits because he just looked totally defeated when he was in, the, in that octagon talking to Joe Rogan after the aftermath. And to see him uplifted and his spirit that high was good to see. But I hope he decides to retire. But it doesn't look that way. Don't get me wrong, if he comes back, defeats Dustin Poirier and once again goes after the lightweight title and once again goes up in weight and gets another title, his career will be so epic, it won't compare to no other career. His career will be up there in the podium of, of podiums. I mean, he'll be up there at Mount Olympus. He'll be Zeus, period. But I don't think that would happen. Uh, a lot of us McGregor fans would like to see it happen, but I don't think so. But anyway, this is Black Shy Guy. Hit the like button if you really enjoyed the video. And thanks for joining me. And thanks for the support. And I'm out of here. That was my thoughts on Conor McGregor's um, Instagram video that's out there. Didn't want to make a long edited video and all of that stuff because you guys seen it. But it is what it is. I'm Black Shy Guy. I'm going to bed. Peace.